Hello, best friend, and welcome, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are all having the most fabulous day, best friend. Girl, listen, I, I, okay, girl, what a night last night. I'm gonna do a full video, but um, Paris invited my husband and I to attend this Simple Life reunion uh, show, which best friend, it was amazing. So I'm gonna spill all the tea about that because so many things actually happened last night. So I'm gonna do a full on video, but I just wanted to give you guys a little heads up because you know I'm, I'm, you know I, I'm cheese mosa. I'm, I, you know I like to gossip and, and give you all the tea. Uh, but best friend, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, my name is Sebastian. Nice spill pop culture tea every day. And best friend, we gotta talk about Justin Bieber, Haley Bieber, Selena Gomez, and and uh, Benny Blanco. So listen, yesterday I made a video about um about this messy ass article, but it is picking up steam. So let's talk about it before we do. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. I would be so grateful, girl. And also, did I wear this the other day, bitch? I have no idea. Listen, I am ADHD like there is no other tomorrow, bitch. I don't know why. My inside out characters up here, they are so confused today, bitch. I don't know what I'm doing with myself today. Uh, but listen, welcome back. Okay, so you guys know the video I did yesterday, right? About this article that it was like, you know, Justin breaks silence and is so tired of, of Benny Blanco and Selena Gomez being um, petty and all of these things. And, you know, that everything that they do on social media is to get back at Justin. And I'm just like, girl, what in the article is going on here? What in the honey boo boo, gypsy rose, mama June, recipes, gypsy rose, TikTok lives is going on here? Honey boo boo's new accent is going on here? You know what I mean? Girl, what? How come everything that Selena Gomez does, everyone wants to, well, not everybody, but like people always want to say like, oh girl, it's all about Justin. Girl, did you see that she woke up and drank coffee this morning? Yeah, because she was trying to get back at Justin because he doesn't like coffee, he likes tea. Like, I don't understand. Do you know what I mean? They really do think that Selena Gomez is harnessed up on a fucking tree with binoculars looking into the damn fucking Bieber household. You know what I mean? Um... Listen, let me, let me, let me, let me tell you something, okay? I, first of all, want to say that, you know, it is, it is so incredible to me that, you know, everything that has to do with Selena Gomez is coming from a negative place, right? And the article was basically about Benny Bl uh, Justin Bieber allegedly missing Benny Blanco. So I did the video and I moved on with it, right? And a lot of us agreed that this article was, you know, was trash. It wasn't true. But, you know, some other publications are now picking it up and it is now having more steam. So what does this tell you, best friend? Could there be some truth to it? Could Benny, uh, could Justin Bieber actually miss Benny Blanco? Like I told you yesterday in my video, girl, yes, I'm pretty sure, you know, that maybe he misses his friend and, 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 you know, all that stuff. And, and, you know, he's, he's, he's sad and, you know, he, he wants to make music with Benny and maybe they had a great time. But now that Benny is with Selena, Justin Bieber has to mature. If this is true, girl, let me tell you something, okay? Let me break it down for you, bitch. If I was a break, if breakout dancer or what is it break up not break up break breakdown what is it you know the that the, they roll on the floor break up break down break 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 dancer break dancer right anyways girl one time i tried to break dance bitch i nearly broke my neck girl how do you do that how do you throw yourself on the fucking floor and twist yourself bitch i look like i was having a fucking exorcism bitch seriously it was not a pretty sight bitch and girl Mm, and I didn't know my 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 uh my pants they fell a little so everybody was watching my my booty and I was just trying to like lift myself off the fucking ground. How the fuck are you supposed to do that? Anyways, girl, listen, right? Um, Justin, if this is true, he needs to he he has bigger fish to fry, girl. He has a whole damn ocean to fry. He has a child on the way. Little Road Plum, little Selena Junior Bieber, uh. Dunk, no, not Dunkin' Do uh Krispy Kreme, uh, Strawberry Glaze, Little Road Junior. Okay, listen, let me tell you something, all right? Um, you know, I I think that, you know, I couldn't touch on this yesterday because, you know, reading, uh, you know, your guys' comments and, and seeing the news, the new articles about this, there's something that I forgot to say yesterday. And I, it, you know, it's like, it does take levels of maturity to be able to be friends with an ex, but I just feel like there has been so much trouble and tribulations in that relationship that I just feel like 
you are so much better alone without each other. You know what I mean? Like Selena is thriving. She is, she is too busy winning awards, getting standing ovations, you know, putting out hit movies, hit TV shows, music, uh, rare beauty of it all, you know, and, and helping mental health, you know, victims, you know, across the world. Um, actually, you know what, girl? I don't think mental health should be called victims. Do you know what I mean? I think we are mental health survivors because you know what? We're not fucking victims. We we go through our mental health issues and you know what? We, we fight hard to overcome them. So girl, we are survivors, okay, bitch? That's right. Uh, but you know, she is she's doing so much for mental health um, and she is literally so fucking busy in her new relationship and everything. So I just don't see how Justin Bieber fits in that equation. Now, the question here is, can Benny Blanco and Justin actually be friends? That's the thing that a lot of people are like really wondering. And, and you know, since yesterday the news came out or, you know, this article came out, they're, you know, they're saying that is it Selena Gomez's fault that Justin and Benny are no longer friends? I don't think it's about being Selena Gomez's fault. I think it's about Benny Blanco understanding that this is fucking weird. You know what I mean? This is weird. I just don't I just don't see why. There are so many other producers and writers out there. Like there has to be a time and a place and a in a space in the Xenon girl, the 21st century, boom, 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 zoom, 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 make my heart go boom, boom, my supernova girl. They gotta be dee bobbity boo themselves, bitch. They gotta hi, my name is Selena Gomez, and you're watching the Disney Channel. You know, it's time to move on, girl. It is time to move on, bitch, okay? It is time to move the F on, girl. And if Justin Bieber is sad about it, girl, take a melatonin, go on a nice nature walk, and worry about your child, and worry about your wife. Because, girl, there is no need for you to worry about what is going on in the Gomez household. Now, some people are saying that this is not true. And I hope that's not true because, listen... With these articles, like I always tell you, you got to take it with a grain of salt, you know? But what I don't like, and the reason I'm making this video, which is seven minutes in, I should have said this from the very beginning, but the reason I'm making this video is because I'm seeing some comments blaming Selena Gomez and saying how she's the one who is taking Benny away from Justin and this and that. Girl, listen, they are in their 30s, okay, girl? You do not have time. You do not have the space. You do not have the energy, nor do you have the patience to deal with any mess, okay? When you moved on, you got to move on. And the only time that you should be looking back is to check out your ass in the fucking mirror, okay? I'm so sorry, but yes, I maybe I'm a revengeful bitch. Maybe this, maybe that. But that energy is long and gone, and you do not need it, bitch, okay? That's all I got to say about that. Anyways, what do you guys think? Do you think that blaming Selena for the, uh, what is it called? Eruption? Not the eruption, bitch. That, the eruption and moist? I can't with those words, bitch. And you know what else I freaking hate? Oh my God. I hate when people say chef's kiss. <gasps> I cannot stand when people say chef's kiss, bitch. It is like, it, it uh, chef's kiss. I'm like, girl, are you a chef? Ramen noodle making motherfucker with the freaking microwave girl. No, you are not a chef. Okay. I cannot stand. And you know what else I can't stand? When people like, when you say something funny, they're like, I am literally dying of laughter. I'm like, bitch, you're not even smiling. How are you dying of laughter? Oh my God. There's, you know what I noticed? There's so many small little things that I cannot stand. You know what else I cannot stand? Oh girl. Yesterday at the Paris Hilton event, right? There was these, okay. I'm, listen, I don't want to be mean. No, you know what? I am going to say it. I don't give a damn. So we were we were there. So Paris invited my husband and I <clears throat> to the filming of the Simple Life show, right? Like a reboot. No, yeah, it's like a reunion show of the Simple Life. And it was amazing. Like you guys are oh my god, it's so good. But I'll go into more detail. You know what I fucking cannot stand? Mean people. So there was these like group of, of guys in front of us and they were so nice. I didn't know any of them. One of them recognized me from my YouTube channel. Hey Chris. And he was so freaking sweet. And uh, whatchamacallit, um, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, they're, they're, then these other two guys, right? They were wearing like sunglasses, like this big, like covering their whole face. Best friend, I think that they thought they were Paris and Nicole. Like not even Paris and Nicole acted this way. The way they just kind of like sized you up and down and looked at you up and down. I'm like, girl, you listen, I don't know. Listen, it is okay to have a high self-esteem, bitch. But when you think you are above everybody, you know what it is? It's 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 clown, clown work. It's clownery, okay? You look a mess doing that shit, okay? And the way they were just like sizing up, and then the guy walked uh over, like past me, and he literally like did this to me. 
and walked around. I'm like, girl, listen, if I was not trying to be good with God, the things I could say, the things I would say, but you know what, girl, that is the past fashion. I'm trying to get good with God. Uh, but you know, I just don't, I hate that. I hate mean people. Like, this is not middle school. You know, this is a celebration of one of the best reality shows in the whole world, The Simple Life. And we are all there, you know, to celebrate Paris and Nicole. Why do you have to be there with such a fucking attitude? And I mean, listen, you know, yeah, some famous people, they have that attitude and stuff. But literally, the stars of the night were the most gracious, humble, grateful people you would ever meet. Paris' husband was so freaking nice. Kathy Hilton was everything. And these two randoms walk in with a fucking stink ass attitude and size people up. Oh, girl, listen, I cannot stand that. I am so grateful and thankful that maybe I'm not the coolest, you know, cup in the in the freezer. But I'm just so grateful to be me, bitch. I wouldn't change it not one bit, girl. I'd rather be humble. I'd rather be thankful. I'd rather be grateful for everything. And I'd rather know that we are all treated equally instead of, of walking on some imaginary cloud that I've created for myself looking a hot ass fucking mess. And you know, the worst part is nobody was, was looking at them and they were acting like they had 50 50 fucking cameras of paparazzi in front of them, girl. Sit the fuck down, bitch, okay? Anyways, I love you guys so much. I'm not even supposed to be screaming, bitch. <gasps> you see, I got my voice back and I'm already fucking screaming, bitch. I can't, I can't do that. This is the last time I'll be screaming for, for the day, okay? Anyways, I love you guys so much. Let me know what you guys think in the comments and I'll see you guys in my next video. Mwah.